Hello, I'm Pastor Dave, and this is our Monday Morning Sermon Recap for Monday, October 23rd, 2023. Here we go. This week we looked at the Gospel of John, chapter 12, verses 1 through 8. And in this passage, Jesus is anointed by Mary in Bethany and teaches the disciples a lesson about how God values gifts. Now, this week was the beginning of our fall series on stewardship, looking specifically this week at transformational generosity. Now, when we look at giving and at our passage from John, we see that gifts that honor Christ have a different meaning. For Jesus, Mary anointing him with perfume had a different meaning than just the cost of that perfume. This actually highlights the idea that there is a difference between earthly value and heavenly value. We see this in passages like the widow's might. And it also impacts our giving today because God places a different value on the gifts we bring than what the world places on them. And this isn't just about the giving, it's also what is done with those gifts. Because people and God will do different things with gifts. One of the ways we physically see this would be in looking at how churches used to be built, where they were seen as showing off the power, glory, might, and all of God. But when others would take a similar amount of money, even less, and spend it on themselves, they build a grand house for their own use as opposed to honoring letting the people all honor God. And it shows that even with the same funds, God will do something greater than what any one person could do. <clears throat> and that reminds us about what can happen with these gifts, that God can transform us and transform gifts. Something we often forget to remember or we just gloss over is the transformational power of faith in Christ in one's life and how we change as we grow in faith and if god can do that to us god can do that with the gifts we bring no matter how great or how small and use those gifts to help transform others it's also the reminder that god wants more than just our earthly wealth and our funds god wants us to give not just wealth but also give up control and let God be at work in this world. When we turn away from ourselves and let God be in control, God's transformational work through Christ will impact everything, including our generosity. So that's your recap for this week. A reminder, we worship every Sunday, Saturday night at 6.30, Sunday morning at 10.45, and we live stream that 10.45 service on the WSUMC Live Facebook page. <coughs> But until next time, I'm Pastor Dave, and I hope to see you in worship.